Okay, here we are in the main program window with the invoices displayed down in front of you. Uh, what we're going to do is uh, update just the ones for the temple. So what you do is you go over the invoice like this, I hope you can see the cursor, and you click on it and it will turn blue. You can do it individually or for as many as you like by just going over them and clicking them. As I said, I'm going to do all the ones from the side. You can't drag a large box as you expect to be able to do in most programs. So you just got to go down carefully, making sure you click the main once or twice, it's going to open the invoice for you to read, which you don't want to do at the moment. Okay, so you can see, hopefully, that I've got all the ones from the 7th in blue. It says they've been printed in this column. A couple of them, three of them, have been posted already. In a minute, if we're successful, we'll see that all the ones in this blue area will have a yes under the posted column. Right, so we've selected everything in blue, and we're coming up to this panel here with the icons. We're going to click on Update. Click that once asks us if we want to update the ledgers. Yes, we do. You can do it to printer, a preview, or a file. Um, I keep it on printer, although you're not actually going to print anything out. But you do have to have it on something, so we're going to say OK to update ledgers. Then we have to wait while the printer goes across, and we get our egg timer. And so it's completed. OK, it's now asking me to confirm printing out. I'm going to do that. So I'm going to click on cancel. I've done that. There's a little flicker through. And you can see all the ones that we selected for the of April are now in the posted box. So they'll now apply to the accounts. And that's all you have to do. I hope that helped.